This video is part of a rod review on the Tenkara Times Next 365 rod. I'm going to attempt to give you both point of view and third person view of various fishing situations using this rod. Here I am on a typical small mountain stream in the Rocky Mountains. This is the first few casts I've made with this rod. It's very light and responsive. The line I'm using here is a uh, number 3.5, 12 foot line. You'll see after a few casts, I'll hook into a um, cutthroat trout. It's about 10 inches long, which is pretty good size for this stream. I don't have my net with me, unfortunately, on this uh, trip, and so I go to lift him up and uh, he gets off and goes right back into the water, which is fine. Here's the third person view of the exact same situation. The advantage of this view is that you can actually see me cast the rod. You can see the flex in the rod with this uh, small line. Um, and see it from a different um, angle. Here's a smoother section of the same stream. I'm using an Amano Kabari and hook into another small trout. This one's smaller, maybe six, seven inches at the most. view of the same fish. portion of the stream with higher flows on a, a different day. I did bring my net with me this time. I'm going to work that current seam that you see just to the right of the large rock in the middle of the stream. And fish came up and uh, hooked in, uh, took the uh, Amano Kabari. Right there. This is a better fish. He's about 12 inches, which is really good uh, size for this stream. Another native cutthroat. You're going to see that I have difficulty holding on to the fish today for some reason. Um, they just keep flopping out, but uh, ultimately it gets released.
Here's the per third person view of the same situation. I need to work on the uh, camera angle, uh, but uh, it still gives you a, a good perspective of the rod and the surrounding area. facing directly into the sun and so you'll see a lot of glare on the water. Now this is even though my point of view camera has a uh, polarizing filter. Um, but you'll see this view from a different angle with the uh, third person view. Here's the uh, third person view. Here I've changed to a very light line. Um, I'm getting a headwind, a slight breeze, and so I'm, I'm actually having to force the cast, um, which makes the cast not very uh, delicate. But I was uh, testing out this line. You can see the line belly there a little bit um, because of the breeze. But I'll hook in, I'll cast right up next to that willow and hook into another um, cutthroat.
the third person view uh, of that same fishing situation. series of uh, third-person views, three fish taken out of the exact same hole, um, and we in just a matter of minutes. I found the Tenkara Times Next 365 5 rod to be a wonderfully light and responsive rod, yet it has uh, quite a bit of backbone for fighting fish and current. None of the fish that I caught were very large, but certainly um, all of the ones that, it, uh, that I hooked during this uh, trial uh, were definitely easily handled by this rod. It's a great rod, and uh, that's it for today.